Welcome back. Well, do you have a child out there who's maybe starting to learn to ride a bike or just wants to have a different way of enjoying a bike? Or maybe mom and dad wants to ride, ride along with them and have some fun as well. Look no further than Glide Bike, and I'm here with Ed. Ed, I tell you what, you have the complete family solution. Born out of experience, some beautiful bikes, and these are really going to be essential in helping, especially that new person learning to ride a bike. Tell us a little bit about your company. Well, we got our start in uh, 2004 with our first prototype. We, uh, I had a daughter that was trying to learn how to ride a bike, and she had the Barbie bike, and it was heavy, and she fell over a couple times, got trapped under the uh, uh, bike, and I had to go lift it up and get it up going again, and she hit a root on the sidewalk, and I said, there's got to be a better way. So I went down in my basement, got some plumbing pipe, some PVC, cut it up, messed around with it, ended up coming out of there with a, a little bike with wheels, and that was it. So my son was the first one to jump on it and go. He was only 18 months old. He immediately took to it. It was snowing out. It was winter time in Boston. And he just took off on it. And uh, thereafter, I had to make a pink one for my daughter. She, they were both out there in the street riding around in circles. And that's how the company got born, uh, out of necessity. That is just amazing. And it really is a great way for them to safely and at themselves, they, they're not afraid, I would imagine, to learn how to ride. Well, one of the things that we wanted to make sure was that I didn't have to be involved. So I was able to put my kid on the bike and let him go. And they were totally self-sufficient on this. They were able to get on it, start out small by just doing little steps, eventually work their way up to actually gliding and putting their feet up on the pegs and then doing figure eights and turning and braking. So we added foot pegs and brakes later on with our production models. So uh, basically, you give it to the kids, they go out and do it. Now I can see, if they choose to, a natural progression to a regular bike. Yes, we found that uh, as little as two years old can actually pedal a bike. My son being one of the first to do it, at about two years and four months old, he was riding a bike around, pedals, no training wheels. Never used training wheels in his whole life. Uh, we have a few kids that have done that. Uh, typically it's three, four years old, but there's some kids that will do it at two, two and a half, no problem. And uh, we've got a lot of kids that at five, six years old, hadn't learned how to ride a bike yet, so we came out with some bigger models, and they're able to just go and go right from that to a bike. Well, Ed, this is just really exciting. Who are we going to be meeting to talk a little bit about the specific models and the different applications? Uh, you're going to meet uh, Michael Bassano. He comes uh, from North Carolina. He was in the Marines, and uh, he sold cars for a while. Now he saw this for his own kids and decided, you know, this is something that he wants to be a part of, this, this revolution. So Easy enough. Well, Ed, thank you so much for being on. Thank you. Joining me right now is Michael Bassano. And Michael, I tell you what, this is an amazing product. It's going to give the child the courage to go out and ride, be able to do so safely, and then maybe make that natural progression to a regular bike. Tell us about what you have here. What we have here is the Mini Glider. The Mini Glider is a 12-inch wheel balance bike. It's made of lightweight aluminum alloy, a 6061 aluminum, which is corrosion resistant, very lightweight at only eight pounds. It has a handbrake as standard on this bike, and what that does is helps the child stop the bike, but also teaches them how to operate a hand bike for future models as they go up in, uh, in different bikes throughout their childhood. Um, moving to the foot pegs, it has removable foot pegs. Uh, once the child starts to go from the walking to gliding and, and gaining their balance, then they can put their feet on the foot pegs. If uh, for some reason in that process they're having a little bit, bit of trouble with the foot pegs in place, they're very easily removed. So you can remove the foot pegs and try it without. And then once the child's comfortable, you can put them back in place very easily. Uh, we tried to make this easy for the child and for the parents. So what we did was we put a quick release seat clamp uh, one of the things that's very important about these bikes for them to uh, you know, do what they're designed to do, which is teach balance, is to have the seat adjusted properly so the child can um, walk the bike first and then begin to run the bike. So you want to have the seat at the right height and you do not need tools to adjust this seat. It's just have a quick release seat clamp so you can raise and lower the seat and then latch it with the clamp. Okay. I noticed it has a kickstand as well. It does have a kickstand. We decided to add the kickstand so the, the bike doesn't just lay on the ground and, uh, and uh, get scratched up or get in the way. So you can you know, store it neatly um, you know, in a garage or in the house uh, you know, with the kickstand. 
Just amazing. Now, in addition to this one here, you have different models to accommodate almost any size, including your newest Super Glide. That's correct. Um, after uh, the success with kids learning how to ride this one, you know, we realized there was a need for one for, you know, maybe kids uh, older than five years old or taller children. So we came out with the Go Glider, which uh, accommodates children five to ten years old, and the Super Glider ten to adult. So, um, you know, everybody can uh, take part in the fun. You know, that's exactly what it is, and you're pulling it together as a family activity at that point. Mom and Dad are right next to uh, little Sally or little Sam, and they're having the same exact fun and almost the same replica bike, and that in itself has to add to the fun. Absolutely it does. Uh, that's the whole idea behind it, you know, uh, with Ed and myself, you know, with getting the families out and getting out there, you know, riding bikes and having fun. Well, Michael, with that said, right now, I know you have to have the attention of all of our viewers out there. What's the best way for them to learn more about Glide Bikes? Uh, the best way to learn more about Glide Bikes is to go to uh, glidebikes.com, and uh, there's a lot of information on there, including contact information, so you can contact us directly, and we can help answer any questions that you may have and find the perfect fit bike for your child. Easy enough. Well, Michael, thank you so much for being on. Thank you very much, Bill.